Hi everyone, in this video I am going to discuss about multi-admin approval in Microsoft Intune. Let's think about a scenario when you have a compromised administrator and if that Intune administrator do any changes on the application and the scripts then it might be possible that the devices which are getting those applications and the script also get compromised. Multi-admin approval help in mitigation of this kind of risk and in this case once you have the multi-admin approval enabled then even if the Intune administrator do any changes in the application or the scripts the changes will not be applied instantly but it will be sent to an other administrator for the approval once the other admin approves the request only then the changes will be applied in the Intune. So let's go ahead and have a look how we can configure this multi-admin approval. Let's go to the tenant administration and we have multi-admin approval here. The first thing what we need to do is to create the access policy. If we click on access policy, click on create and let's name it. You can either create this policy for script or the application. Let's go ahead and do it for the apps as of now. Click on next. And now we have to add the group where we have all the approvers. Let's go ahead and search for the group. I have created a group, multi-level admin approvers, and all my admins who will be approving the request is already a member of this. Select this. And let's go ahead and click next and create. Now let's log in with the other administrator and try to do any changes in the application. And let's see if we are getting a request to approve here in the portal. I have logged in within other administrator and um, let's go to application and windows. These are all the applications listed. Let's try to do any changes in one of the application. And let's try to do changes here. You can see here that we have an option to review and submit for approval. Let's click on this and we need to provide the justification and submit for the approval. Let's go back to the portal now. And let's go back to the admin console over the other user. And if I go to receipt request and refresh here then I can see that there is another request which I have received for the name changed. If I click on this, it is showing me that what is the new changes which will be applied. Earlier it was like this. The display name was with DC and now the display name is changed. And now you go ahead and approve the request. Status is approved now. And now the status is changed to completed. It means Intune automatically did the changes once the admin, appro admin approves it. I hope this will be informative for you. Please do share and subscribe if you want watch sharing it.